Hello everyone, I hope you all have a good day. Today is kind of special since we have a holiday here, so I thought it would be time to do a little video, and this time we're gonna tackle OpenBSD's HTTPD, or some call it OpenHTTPD. First of all, I prepared a little thing for us. Let me go to my OpenBSD machine. There we go. Let me quickly get root. So, here we are. So, first of all, if you want to use HTTPD, you first of all have to create a config file and you have to enable the service. And obviously you need something to serve. I prepared a little website for us. First things first, we go to Etsy and on OpenBSD, which is very great, there is an examples directory and as you can tell it ships quite a lot of example configurations. In our case we are using httpd.conf like this and I will just copy it here since I'm already in Etsy. In this very case I don't need to do that. For you it would be you know this step copying it over. So next we are going to edit our httpd.conf and as you can tell it is very basic, very simple, um, just a short explanation here since there is really not much to see. First of all we declare the server. In my case I set up a DNS record, an A record on my local DNS machine, um, bsd.7.lan, this is my local domain that I'm hosting. I listen on port 80 with everything, you know, everything that comes over port 80 it will answer to and you need to specify the root. This is where your website will lie, your index.html or index.php or whatever you might have. In this very case it's a very basic static website. Make sure to save that. There we go. And next step we need to enable HTTPD. You're gonna do that with rcctl. Mine was already enabled but I'm showcasing it anyway. And make sure you have it started. So, now we have one thing to take care of. As you saw in the config, let me go back to it. This root directory, this is not the root of the file system. This is the relative path from where it's truded. Let me show you. So, under war, dub dub dub, you can see there is an htdocs folder. There it is, a directory. And from what you can tell, I have already created a BSD directory. Everything that's directly in htdocs BSD, like we specified in the config, will be accessible to the web server. In my case, you can tell I have an index.html file already in there. Alright, so since we started it, let's check if our domain name is resolvable and it very much is. We can also do a curl to check it, but in this very case I'm quite certain that it is set up right. So the only thing to do would be this, 7.lan, and there we have it. Just a little website I've drawn together just to showcase uh, OpenBSD's HTTPD and well from here on out it's pretty much only limited by your imagination. So I thank you guys and have a good day.